Welcome to Miller's Monsters and I have a haunted place for you today and this is the Brown Lady's Lair in Rhineham Hall, England and she's called the Brown Lady because that's the uh, color of the pro-cad dress that she wore. What a pro-cad dress is, I don't know. I'll have to look it up or you can look it up. Let me know in the comments. I probably won't look it up so if you're waiting for an answer you're not going to get it. <laughs> Um, but her, the first sighting was in 1835, uh, Christmas, at a Christmas gathering at, at the uh, Norfolk, England estate. Uh, two guests claimed they saw the brown lady, and uh, the next evening one of them uh, glimpsed the female phantom once more. But this time he noticed two gaping black holes uh, for her eyes, where her eyes should have been. And, uh, of course, word got out, and a lot of servants quit that day, I tell you. Or at least the article tells me, and I tell you. Um, and then, it was seen again in 1836 by uh, Captain Frederick Marriott. And uh, he wanted to go there because he believed that uh, this was uh, just a, a fairy tale or folklore brought up by uh, smugglers. To keep people away from the place and well he learned the hard way it wasn't uh, she appeared outside his doorway and uh, uh, she carried a lighted lamp and uh, you know so she could show her features and grinned in a malicious and diabolical manner very scary indeed and then uh, she was saw again or actually photographed supposedly in uh, 19 58 and um, I will put this photo up now but this is one of the uh, most famous uh, pictures of a ghost uh, at the time and um, of course uh, a lot of people have uh, skeptics of it say yeah, it's a double exposed film or grease on the lens cap uh, or even that the figure itself that you looked at is uh, that of the Virgin, a statue of the Virgin Mary. So, you know, it's your choice. Believe or don't believe.